SMS. All right, what up, Gary? Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Tuesday, a beautiful, beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in celebrity news, y'all. Beyonce's mother, y'all. Tina knows, y'all. They're saying that she did the unthinkable, honey, recently on Instagram. Now, they're saying, y'all, that the 66-year-old grandmother appeared to be popping pills and get drunk. Why on social media, y'all? Now, they're saying Miss Tina did a video telling her fans, y'all, that she was bored at her beautiful mansion and that she decided to get drunk, honey, and take some pre prescription pills. Now, she said some doctor was talking about, you know, how to get in your get into yourself or whatever it was she was saying he told her to do and say do, honey. So she decided to do it. But then, at the end of the video, honey, she said she was just joking. I'm like, I know doggone well Tina ain't that crazy, honey, popping pills and, and drinking all the alcohol she was drinking. But then, too, when you're bored at home, I guess you can't do some of those things. But some people saying, honey, um, her husband must have been away doing a movie or, honey, being um, quarantined somewhere else and not with her. So she decided to do a video. But I think Miss Tina Tool to be staying on Instagram like that. She needs to. Oh, she's yeah. just enjoying herself, Gary. Everybody's yeah. so bored right now. She's just yeah. poking, having a little fun. Well, where's Rumi and Suri and Blue Ivy? With their mama. Well, they need to be with their grandmother then. Yeah, Why? but she. They got a mansion quarantine them each on oh, each wing of the doggone house. Hell, they don't need to be each wing. You said that, okay? Each nah, wing, each wing, honey, of the house. Cause so trust me, they got some wings. And I'll be staying on the wing of love. <laughs> okay. On the wing of love. <laughs> 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 yes, sir, honey. So, but anyway, congratulations, Miss Tina. She bored, honey. She Ms. Tina, the world, honey, honey, on drugs. <laughs> okay. Nah. Oh, stop, honey. All right, moving on in other celebrities. Now, this is an interesting story, Ricky. Y now, y'all help me out with this now. Iman Shumper, y'all, he's the husband mm -hmm. of Miss Tiana Taylor, y'all. They recently, oh, now, this is interesting. No. Yeah, they did a list, honey. He recently gave Tiana a list of celebrity women, y'all, that he slept with. He said he gave her this. They exchanged this list so that they would never, honey, be caught off guard, honey, in an awkward moment. Or if someone was treating them weird, they could make sense of why that was happening. Is that good to do? What you mean? You know, give a list of the people you slept with to your mate. So, like, you know, it, it, it depends on how good y'all relationship is. It depends yeah. on how cool y'all are, how good y'all relationship is. And if you jealous and you a hater and you ain't secure with yourself, then you shouldn't do that. Well, and, Brad. It depends on if you, you have no been surprises. very active. You know, if you found yourself very active in the entertainment life and you've dated quite a few people and you guys are both entertainers, it might behoove you to let, you know, your partner know who they in the room with. That's true. Yeah. So, Ricky, what you think That's about true. this? So, would you give a list to your mate, honey, let them know, okay, I slept with A, B, and C. So, like, if your mate and y'all go to a party <laughs> and A, B, and C just happen to come around. She you know, better, they better get some credit report paper. That credit <laughs> report... <laughs> All that bad credit. <laughs> Front and back. Yes, uh, oh, my God. Get some, Wilt, list, huh? some Wilt Chamberlain sheets. Oh, Lord. Jesus. It's, it's, a, it's a protective measure, Gary. I don't protective. think it has anything. It's a protective measure. It has nothing to do with security. You know, they're most well, likely very secure in their relationship. But just so you're not caught off guard, because women out there, these little side pieces can get real but petty. What? But what they yeah. really need to worry about who you still emotionally attached uh, to. It ain't about who you Ricky. slept with. It's the one. It's the one that you wake up and go to bed and think about every night for the rest of your what? life, and that one you just can't ever get over, emotionally <laughs> and mentally. See that? You know, mm. And, and it's deeper than a, it's a soul tie mixed with love. But well, that's it's, the one they don't tell it. you about, Ricky. Ooh, Nobody gonna talk about that. Well, we need it, to talk about yeah, that. Yeah, I don't even bring that up. I just, you know, some stuff you just better keep it to yourself because they gonna always mm. be jealous. But I promise. Everybody got that one. I don't care who you with. Mm -hmm. Everybody got that one that you at least think about when you wake up or before you go to bed. That your last thought. And I, oh, I, yeah. I, 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 I put that on Black Tony Pitbull puppies. I bet you Rock T not like that. Rock T don't think that way. Boy. Huh, Rock well, he, no, Rock T ain't. He, like luck, that. he lucky enough to be with to be with that person. No. Yeah. yeah, he lucky enough Absolutely. to be with that person. Boy, Shoot. boy, boy. <laughs> What'd you put that on, Ricky? I put that on Black Tony Pitbull puppies. I ain't lying about that one. It's always that one that you just think about before you go to bed and when you wake up in the morning. This this one that you'll tolerate morning breath. Oh, you don't be kidding. Like uh uh. So, you need to tell me, damn it. I don't want to know. That, 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 boy, that, one, that one that lay you on their lap and dig in your ear and then bust them black heads. Oh, Wait a minute, man. Now, hold up. And then got that, got that little napkin and then dig in your ear yeah. with a bobby pin or a, a, uh, or, ooh, a, a, or a barrette clip. It can't be that damn much love if you ain't still with him. So 
Well, I mean, some of some of you be in love with them, but they be crazy as hell. That part. Yeah, yeah, they be they be yeah. crazy. You can't be with somebody because sometimes you have to say it like I'm really in love with this person forever, but she's not worth my life. She's not worth me going to jail. She ain't worth my life and me losing my you know because you got to put your that, kids first. Like I she love got that fire, Ricky. I, you gonna go to jail? Man, it's just more to say. It's it's a mind thing. It's a mind <laughs> thing. Yeah, because some of them will make they'll make you they'll make you kill them. Yeah, I'm not saying I'm not violent. I'm not advocating violence, but it's some <laughs> that'll get you out of your character and get the uh, wiggling that neck in your face and clapping in your face and all that kind of stuff. Uh, you're being, oh you're being jailed. I like the clappers, honey. <laughs> no, sir. Uh, uh, Gary, what's your next story? The color today, y'all. Yeah, it's not my favorite color. My color today is fresh air. How do you get through all that? On the high end, you say fresh air. On the low, you say beautiful light blue. That's your color for the day. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all give it up for Gary with the Z. All right, y'all. Hey, it is uh, Talking Out Tuesday, man, and everybody. 